infiltration and it'll basically absorb into the material and strengthen it. Um, a lot of people don't do that because they just want to look at it so they don't need that kind of strength. Um, but what allows it to be freely moving? Does there is there a substrate stu- substrate that it dissolves or something? What do you mean by allows like, it to be freely like moving? That this part oh, can oh. rotate? I'll explain that in just okay. a second. You 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 notice the the feel of this, it's got a, a plaster feel to it. It's not plastic. It's a plaster base. So it's like it's pottery. Like, uh, it can it's like clay. It can be strong, but if you drop it, it's probably gonna shatter. Mm. Right? So it's not it's it's primarily for communication, for modeling, concept modeling. We do, uh, you know, medical modeling. We do, on the other side, uh, we had some examples of little robots and things, you know. We're doing a lot of applications in print. Uh, figurines, wedding cake toppers where we scan and you can put your real face on it and all that kind of stuff. So look, this is used a lot for these kind of consumer products. Disney's uh, using this technology. They scan at the theme park. You can get your daughter's face on the princess character. 